All right, so we're here. We're at Cross America Event Center tonight. It's the start of the first day of the Kickstart. And I, I decided to film this because they never really film Kickstarts. I think I have like one Kickstart on my channel and I barely filmed anything. But we're here at the building and we're all getting ready. We got Sister Lorelai right here. Huh? New shirt that you're wearing today. I know my new shirt. If you watched the previous video on this channel. He was really excited to wear it today. I was very excited. Very excited. Blue is my color. It does look good. She's not wrong. All right, so we're going into the building right now. Let's get it. We're going in. <laughs> Wait for Dylan to hold my door like. I, well, yeah, I, it would be easy to hold the door without the camera. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we are, guys. Yes. Oh, wow. All right, so right now, everybody is setting up in here. There's a bunch of children in here, as you can see. So it's pretty loud in the background. We got Exona. She really wanted to be in the video. Yes, I do. Block the face. You need to be shown. <laughs> uh, anyways, I'm going to turn the camera off for a little bit and help out. But I'm going to vlog as much as I can. Uh, my boy Junior, he loves the coffee here. Yes. Tell him how good this is. Okay, if, if it was from a scale of 1 to 10, this would be... 10,000. 10,000. 10, this is literally the first thing that we did when we got in here. I mean, we're still setting up, obviously, but we had to make time to come to this I place. I introduced you to this place. It's really good. Oh, maybe not this place, but this. Honestly? I put you on the ice milk a latte. It might just be as good as Taylor's coffee bus. <laughs> I don't want to be on camera when you say that. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> I'm excited. I'm more than excited. Oh, did I get a straw? Oh, I did. I gotta get it in. Come there on. We, go. we got it, we got it. Good job. So I'm going to be doing what I'm best at here at the Kickstart. Brad's pretty neat in charge of camera duty. And you know, yeah. you know I'm good with those camera angles, so. It's all about the angles. So this is pretty cool. We just got my DJI mic attached to the sound oh. system here. So now Brad's gonna be able to move yeah. around, you know, and it's gonna be really good. Test, how does that sound? Can you hear very well or is it a little quiet? We're just testing the audio right now with the DJI mics. See, I knew these would come in handy. It was weird because it was like, should I bring my bag here? Because my bag's like pretty heavy now. And I knew I had to bring my bag because he really wanted to use the wireless mics. Okay, so we decided we're not using the DJI mic. He's back to the cord mic. Whatever you wanted wireless. Yeah. They told well, me wireless. The wireless wasn't going as planned. Action! Welcome to the Cross America building. <laughs> We have paparazzi. We have What's up, paparazzi? Do you want my autograph? Hey. Hey. Are you vlogging idea. for Truth for Youth? <laughs> and this is what? Are you vlogging right now? Um, no. I'm Why are you so tiny? Hey. Pop Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Rich Twins. So today we're going to be talking about our daily income. You know, how much does dad give you? So dad gives me $10,000 a month. No way. Yes, he does. Yes way. But he gives him 15000 because he's his favorite. He's I'm not jealous. He's actually out at the golf course right now in Florida. And, um, you know, he's he's buying another cheesecake factory. <laughs> Pan over. <laughs> that was funny. There's your mom. She left us. <laughs> really? You had to bring up the pain again? <laughs> I'm sorry, you gotta Hi, deal with I'm your done issues. With show. <laughs> hey, Karen. And these are moments before the Kickstarter. I hope you're enjoying this vlog so far. Yes, I hope you are enjoying our real comedic side before we start. Um, we have nothing to do right now except drink some water and walk around. Mm -hmm. So I hope you give us a thumbs up, you subscribe to our channel, leave us a comment. Yes, please tell us how great we are thank you so much I had an addiction to pornography she didn't know that I cussed because I managed to not do it at home she didn't know I was a liar because I was a convincing one we went door knocking through here the other day and and I was amazed I was amazed I mean you know anybody time anytime someone knocks on your door it's just like uh, what does this person want what are they trying to sell what are they whatever and we we're just like hey I mean it was 98 degrees that day it was a terrible I mean, it was a great day but it was a terrible day to go door knocking I'm just telling you it was we were sweating, we'd drink a, like a giant bottle of water. So it says, after these things, the Lord appointed 70 others also and sent them two by two before his face into every city and, and places where he himself 
was about to go. Then he said to them, the harvest truly is great, but the laborers are few. Therefore pray the Lord of the harvest to send out laborers into the harvest. All right, so I want you to pray a simple prayer. You're just gonna speak to his body. You can speak to his hands and to his knees and say, hands and knees, I command you to be healed in Jesus' name. Fingers, I command all mobility to return right now. Knees be healed in the name of Jesus. Ankles, hips, back, I command you to be made new right now. Every lie broken right now. I speak peace right now, right now. I command you to come out right now. That every lie of the enemy is broken right now. I command depression to go. I command every lie to be broken in the name of Jesus. I got a bunch of children near me. Alyssa, do your job. Do your job. They were all on me earlier. I have, I don't have evidence, but they were. All right. Um, let's see. Get, get on your knees. You'll come forward and then go back. Yeah. Rise up with Christ. And we command every unseen spirit to go right now in the name of Jesus. I command that spirit of deafness, that spirit of death, to come out of him right now in Jesus' so it's still day two of the kickstart me and nolly are just hanging out talking brotherly conversation just opening up my heart to him which i never do to anybody so this is a rare moment but it's been rough for the past few days it's been you know? really hard for him but you know, these things happen at kickstarts. <laughs> Attacks happen, and you just gotta endure, actually. He has a new tattoo, you know? It's my new tattoo. Endure, what's it say? I can't even read it from here. Endure to the end. Endure to the end. It was backwards on my arm, so. <laughs> yeah, that's all I'm doing. This is, uh, my goal is to make it to the end, and to look at Christ. And just be like, I did this for you. I didn't want to do this. It was hard, but I knew I had to do this. Well, right now, I'm currently just sitting alone. Nobody's around me. As you can see, today's just been, God's like, I don't know what he's doing right now. And that's a common thing in the kingdom is we just live this life not knowing the steps that are ahead. That's my walk though, I never know. This turns a bad day into a great day. With pizza. Amen. With pizza? Food can't hurt you. I mean, it can, but not your heart at least. If it doesn't well, it can do that too. It makes you stronger. I mean, look at this guy. Yeah. I want to be in the video. You're Hi. always in the video. You need I to know, because I'm famous. <laughs> I don't be in the video. I took, I took a piece of someone's pizza. That's uh, good. Mmm. 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 Mm. This is where I lay it down Every lie and every doubt This is my surrender But we will use our words because you're so worthy It's all we have, God Praise you, Jesus Hallelujah, God Hallelujah, Father You are so good You are so good You're coming He's coming All right, so right now me and Nolly get a little bit of a break, uh, bathroom break, you know, everybody's just walking around right now. So I decided I gotta take a thumbnail for this whole video. Oh, so yeah. we're going to the front of the building to do that right now. You know, big camera, I'm saying. Yeah. What's you saying, Junior? Nothing. Are you sure? Yeah. I don't know. Hey, Nolly. Say hi to YouTube. Hi, YouTube. Okay. <laughs> so anyways, it is the last day. I'm gonna be ending the video today, finally. So there's still a good amount of people here at the Kitsert, which is nice because, you know, it could always change back and forth depending on each day, but people just return, which is good. They're hungry, so. It's pretty good, we still got a bunch of people in here. It's amazing. Jesus instructs them, he says, don't take a money belt, don't take 
extra sandals, don't take extra clothes, don't take all this other, th don't take all these things. A worker's worthy of their wages. When you find a home of peace, go into that home. And if it's worthy of your, of your blessing, then you let your peace stand and, and you stay in this home and you abide with them and you teach them and instruct them and pray with them and, and, and all of that. If you look out in this parking lot, you're going you're gonna to see cars with Florida plates, Georgia plates, uh, Michigan plates, and, and plates from all over the place. And then whenever you leave here, you're going to go back to those places and there may not be anyone else that thinks like you, believes like you, prays like you, or any of that. And that's a tough place to be. The model is going to probably look like for a little while going forward is that we're going to have a kickstart and then we want to follow the kickstart up with getting home fellowships set up in, in, the, in, this, in this area. We're so close, and I, and I know people have been saying this forever. I mean, they were saying it in Acts. The, we're at the end of the age, you know, we're the, you know, but we're, it's undeniable just how things are changing and, and we must be recognizing the seasons that we're in. And you know what? I believe it'll be in my lifetime, but my grandparents were probably saying the same thing. Um, so whether it's in my lifetime or six generations from now, I don't know. Because Jesus said no one knows the time or the hour. Iron sharpens iron, right? It talks about a two-stranded cord or a three-stranded cord. Like we need each other where two or three are gathered together in my name. Uh, you know, we need each other to, um, to continue to grow. It says, don't forsake the assembling of yourselves together for the spurring on of lo in, in love and in good works. Right, so maybe maybe you've been in kind of a, like a stagnant place for, for a week and you're just like, oh, I'm just not feeling my relationship with God is just it's feeling stale. It's just, uh, I don't even wanna go to the you know, fellowship tonight, but I'm gonna go ahead and go and you show up and someone's like, man, I went and prayed for someone today and they had jaw cancer and they felt their jaw burning while I prayed for them. And then they went to, they went to uh, then they went back to the doctor. They had an appointment the next day and they did all these scans and they said they're healed. Dude, I'm so amazed. They said they want to get baptized and everything. And you're sitting there going, man, I'm just not feeling. No. All of a sudden, you're like, whoa. And you're like getting super like pumped up. Someone else is like, yeah. This was awesome. This is actually, this is the first kickstart in, in Indiana. But this is also the first kickstart that I've ever done. I've never done a kickstart before. Um, but I've been to several of them. Um, I hope you guys have got something out of it. And, you know, we want to stay connected. And we hope to stay in contact with a bunch of you, especially all that are from Indiana. Oh, I guess there's still... Um... This is where the video ends. We always gotta have that ending now, so if you enjoyed, make sure you hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Comment down below, and I hope to see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.